I believe it was a long, long way from home. I was surprised at how uh, Mick was so adept at, at uh, guitar hooks and riffs. It was a story about me moving from Rochester to New York City, you know, from a small town to the Apple in Decay, because I think at that time there was a garbage strike going on, and it smelled like it was in decay. <laughs> it was a show outside of Washington, D.C. It was a rock club. I can't remember what the name of the place is. I should remember, but... Uh, and uh, we, we were so amped up to do, get our first show under our belt. I don't remember much about it. <laughs> well, Dennis and I were riding in uh, from Westchester into New York City for rehearsal. We heard um, WNEW uh, uh, and they were saying uh, that this was a new band and here was their first single. And, and we started hearing the, the chords, the feels like the first time. Dennis had to pull over the side of the road before he lost control of the car. We were jumping up and down in the car and it was insane. We just pulled over and turned the radio off. I think we were opening for the Doobie Brothers. That whole atmosphere uh, of, a, of a packed audience and, and the heat and the smoke and uh, the aromas that were floating around in the air. And uh, it was it was very exciting and, and uh, to go on first to open for the Doobies, we had our work cut out for us. I was nervous. Uh, I had been doing a lot of studying of lyrics. I had lyrics all over the house because you think you can sing a song when you're in the shower until you have to sing the first word of every line. And uh, so when I came in uh, to play, I was prepared and serious and probably gave everybody probably a little bit of a wrong impression of myself. It was a big deal. This is, this is a big band. Well, the first time uh, Mick and I uh, performed together uh, after at least a decade uh, uh, was the Songwriters Hall of Fame. It was a, a monumental moment for the both of us. It was unbelievable uh, reuniting with him and, and performing on stage again with him.